9-11 changed a lot of things here in this country, including discussions about the importance of mental health among first responders. Eyewitness News reporter Aaron Roney explains the role the attacks played in the lives of fire crews moving forward. Aaron? Dave, Rochelle, many made the choice to work on the front lines because of the tragedy that happened on 9-11. But it's a career that's also coming with a lot of trauma on its own. I spoke with a former Kern County Fire captain to talk about how 9-11 shaped the way we treat mental health in our first responders. You can ask anyone where they were and what they were doing September 11, 2001, and they remember the exact moments. I literally walked into work and that's when I found out was when I walked into the fire station and the guys were just sitting there staring at the TV, just in complete um, silence and just um, stunned. For Derek Robinson, who is a former Kern County Fire captain, he says that day serves as a reminder just how traumatic the job can be. It's always in the back of your mind and you're, you're just cognizant of it. You do your best you can to train and prepare and be ready for the when those calls do come. The tragedy of that day has impacted how the mental health among people like firefighters is handled. But Robinson says it's something that still needs a lot of work. It started a process. I don't think we're all the way there yet. I think it's still, there's still a stigma attached with uh, mental health and behavioral uh, health. And we really need to do a better job of raising the uh, curtain on these things and, and making People know that it's okay to not be okay. Robinson says there's a misconception that all it takes is just one big moment to break someone down. People think that to have those types of issues, it has to be a singular big event like a 9-11 when it can be a cumulative trauma over the span of a lifetime. And one of the best analogies I heard was if you have a beautiful car and you take care of it on the outside, it looks great. But if you don't take care of the engine inside, it doesn't run very well. And coming up at 6 o'clock, we talk about improving mental health for future generations of firefighters. Live in studio, Aaron Roney, Eyewitness News. Is there a story you think we should investigate? Call our Eyewitness News tip line at 869-2929.